Alright, I am here with the review that I said I would do. I know no one watches these videos, but uh, I enjoy making them. I don't know why it takes me a while to set this freaking crap up, because I don't have a tripod or shit, because I don't want to go professional on this. Because it's kind of retarded itself. But, um, what's it called? Before the video starts, I just wanted to point out, Swaggles and Marvin, I've no I know you've been criticizing me for these videos. And I just wanted to say, Swaggles, you're buying that Marvel vs. Capcom shit comes with four figures. Okay, you're gonna have collectible figures too, but you, I'm not insulting you for it. I'm just pointing it out right now, because I know you've been criticizing me. So, I don't know what you're criticizing at this point, because you're gonna have figures, I'm gonna have figures. Oh well, like, why? I don't know why you're gonna make fun of me for it. Marvin, just sit your fat ass down. Literally, no one likes you. You are annoying. That's probably why 50% of the time you're muted by, like, everyone in the group. But that's, that's beside the point, I'm not here to rant and shit. Um, I'm just here to review. First, I want to point off the box. The The box is actually slightly bigger than the barricade box. Here, I'll put them together. It's like a whole freaking thing. I don't know. What, what is this crap called? It's full of border? I don't know. A uh, barricade box, of course, has like the designs on the top. I really like that. Really bums me out. Is that the... Um, I'm not going to show my reflection. It's going to look like garbage. The top of it for the Optimus Prime box and have jack shit on it. But, what's it called? Here's the front of it. I really like the pose he's in. Side, Earth's greatest protector. You can't even see that. I'm not even going to focus it for you guys. Back, 30 steps. Um, there he is in his pose. You can't even see this crap. What am I saying? I can just do this. Wow, the magic. Oh. What's going on? Now I assume you guys can see that Earth's greatest protector. Yeah, there you guys go. What's it called? So yeah, that's, that's the box. And 30 steps. Jesus Christ. This took me three hours to transform. I could not get this shit to work. And even now, freaking the, the top of it, just kind of right here, pops off. I'm not sure why, but I guess I'm just going to have to live with it. Because three or four hours to make. I can't even remember at this point. But it was so much. Okay? It pissed me off. Like, I think I, I broke a cup. I didn't break anything, actually, but let's come. There's hinges that, like, don't even work anymore, so I had to, like, repair them. Even though, actually, I didn't even repair them. What am I saying? Here are the instructions. They are actually a lot bigger than the, um, other instructions for barricade. Yeah, they're just long. Fuck the instructions. I don't give a shit about them. Compared to the other figure, barricade. Um, barricade's slightly smaller, but that's just how it is in the movies, I guess. Well, what am I saying? I guess I know that. From the side, from the back, from the other side, even though it's the same exact thing. And yeah, there's there's barricade. It has fully functional wheels, which is good. And the bottom, you have his sword, which is better. Yeah, okay, don't do what I just did. But basically, you can just slide it back up there, which sounds kind of weird. <laughs> What's it called? So yeah, there's that. Up here, you have his shield. What's it called? Nice, I really like the colors on this. Um, let me just scoot this up a little, I'm not sure what's going on. There goes my finger in the camera, how unprofessional of me. Doesn't matter though, I don't give a shit. <sighs> okay. So there's that. Shield, and then if you want to transform it, take out the sword. Transformation, it's a lot easier to transform than to actually, like, make into a car. So what you want to do first, you kind of want to... Hinge this, pull it up, pull it back, and just leave it back there. And then what you want to do next is kind of unhinge the doors. So like this. And then kind of fold them back. Actually, you want to pull the top just up for now. And then fold the wheels in the... For God's sake, look, this is what I'm talking about. All these little blue hinges. They keep on coming off. So I guess you just kind of squeeze them. And then you put them back. Like so, which, I don't know, it's kind of a garbage system. But I don't know, the hinges are so loose. Um, then you want to do the same with the other door, and then you want to put this thing back. Then what you want to do is open up the back, like this. And you want to kind of take these things up here up, the little flame parts. You just kind of want to slide them off on each side. Now it can get really confusing here. Because these are his legs. And yeah, it's, it's really weird. But 
I'm always having to adjust the camera, I guess. I should have been prepared from the beginning, but I guess this is this is the consequences. Alright, so there this is the hard part. You gotta be aware with this. Let me move this crap to the side. Just kinda unslide them and then his legs, which are these, you have to unhinge them. You wanna kinda pull these to the side and then pull them all the way back. And now that we're on the back, the this little gray tab right here, you just kinda wanna untab that and you wanna fold them down. If they do come off, just put them back. Fold them down. Okay. And uh, there you go. There's the the legs, the foot. You want to pull it down. Try not to break them. And you want to twist them to the s leg. <clears throat> and then you want to do this. You want to do it the same to the other leg. Bring it down and then spin it to the leg. And then you're left with these, these things. Now he's just kind of being really retarded. It's really retarded. So there's that. Next, what you want to do with the things right here, you want to kind of... Okay, let me show you guys. You want to pull it out, and then just kind of rotate it under. Uh, don't break it, though. Ro pull it out, rotate it under. Okay. Then just leave those there. You don't have to. And then what you want to do is this little flap. You want to kind of not flap, but... Oh my god, you guys aren't even getting a good view. What am I saying? Okay, next, what you want to do is kind of want to grab it. And you want to just 180. Switch to the side. And then bring his little knight thing down. And then there's that. And then for the legs, you just want to kind of... What I usually do is, because I don't know really how it goes, you just kind of want to twist it until you find its way. Just like that. If it does break, you can put it back on, but... Uh, why don't we go in? That's weird. There it goes, it goes. Okay, it went in. And just like that. Same with the other leg, you just kind of want to twist it around until you find where it goes. Unless you know what way it goes by memory. Then do that. And then for his arms, just pull them apart. Okay. And then, you just want to kind of bring out his head from the middle, like so, and then, hold on, let me, yeah, move this thing back, move his head up, and then bring his chest piece up, and then kind of a little, whatever the fuck these things are, bring them up, like that, and then do it to the other one, okay, and then his arms, looks like he's done, but he's not, these little red hinges up here. I'm gonna bring them back and then clip them on like that. Same with the other one. You just wanna bring it up, clip it down, and then you wanna twist his arm, twist his arm, his right, his leg. And you just kind of position him, and then I have these hinges, dude. They they really oh, look at the fuck. Oh my god, they come off easily, man. It's jack shit. Okay. I'm just gonna pull him over his arm because he's a knight. That. <clears throat> and like that. Oh my god. And just like that. He's actually really easy to stand, but it's hard leaning over the camera and positioning him. Okay, I guess that's like the best thing we'll get him into. Just for now. So there he is. Um, there's Optimus. He looks kind of retarded with his arm out. I'm just kind of bring it back. Put a sword in, however the hell you want it to go. Put a shield, just twist his arm like that. He doesn't want to break that hinge like I did. And just kind of pull that down. There he is. The Optimus. Um, pull a sword like that. So there he is like that. Here, I'm going to transform. He's like little baby barricade again. Let me transform him really quickly. It won't take long, I promise. If you want, you can just skip like 10 seconds ahead. I don't care. Because I want to I wanna compare them. So I can show you guys what they look like next to each other. Because there's actually a really big difference. I didn't think there'd be much of a difference when I got them. I was like, oh crap. It's going to be the same size. It's going to be awesome. But that's not the case. 
I guess they made them just like how they are in the movies, which is awesome. So, it's nice. So, let me just quickly do this. this. I also did a barricade review. So, if you'd like to see that video, I'll look for it on my channel. Also, while I'm just putting on this crap, one of my videos got fucking 700 views. It's called Minecraft How Sex Works. That video was meant as a joke, but I guess a bunch of horny 12-year-olds found the video and thought it was real. It's really retarded, but I guess horny 12-year-olds will be horny 12-year-olds. So, now finishing up Barricade. Here's Barricade. He's actually really hard to position, but you know what? Let me do that. Okay, you know what? Fuck you, Barricade. You, you don't want to stand? I'm not. I'm not going to force you to. I'm not gonna force you to stand, okay? You can go against the wall, you're a bitch. So there they are together. There's a massive size difference. I don't I don't mind that at all. That's what she said. Um basically oh my god, the Optimus is such a cool thing to look at. Like I like these things. It's like car junk. Cause like on the back it barricades whole hood. Not hood. It's like back like the um, the car. It just kinda pokes out and it looks really, really weird. It doesn't look bad. This looks kind of weird and clunky. But with Optimus, like, I guess his, his fronts, they make good use. Because on the side, they look really cool. This is more, looks like part of his um, knight armor. The sword color, which is not even in the movie. I don't even think it's orange. It's like red, I think. Um, it's orange. I don't know. I really like that color, I guess. Same with the blue shield and the blue eyes. It's so cool. Like Those colors are just so bright, vibrant. And it, especially with his armor, it's just like a... Nice light blue in the movie. We've been seeing a lot of his, um, more darkish blue, I guess. It's not that dark, I guess, but I mean, it's, it's pretty dark. It's not that dark, though. But it's just really light here, and it's just cool. I also like the, the cool silver metal on the legs. It's a really nice addition to the figure. Awesome. It's enough of Barry Keane. That's the size difference. Basically, I really like this figure a lot. And, I mean, the, the rotation's good. You got the arm rotations, the hinges, which I really fucking hate because they come off a lot. You, there's no feet rotation, sadly. You can pull it down, which I don't know why you'd want to do that. There's leg rotation, up, down, whatever, what you want to do. There's a, a peer rotation, too, like with the um, elbows. Uh, no wrist rotation, which is kind of a shame. I actually really like the wrist rotations. In fact, did, yeah, Barricade had... Did, did he? Yeah, Barricade had fist rotation. Um, I mean, wrist. Yeah, no, yeah, wrist rotation. I mean, it's not much of a wrist rotation, I guess. But, it's a really good figure. The Knight Armor Optimus. It's just really cool. And, what's it called? What else was I going to show? I don't think I was going to show anything. I think, I'm not going to transform him into a car. Which I think I did for Barricade, because, you know what? Fuck it, I'm going to do it. I don't, I don't care. Optimus, you just want to take off his his shit <clears throat> like that, and then, dude, my back fucking hurts. I really need something to sit on. You know what? This is really unprofessional, but I could give less shit. So... No, never mind. It's not gonna work out. Fuck it. I'll just sit here gasping for air because I'm so unhealthy. So basically, what you want to do the first steps is. You want to pull down his chest pieces right here. Kind of pull them down like you pulled them up. And then you want to kind of lift it lift it up. And then pull it down. Actually lift it up again. And then like that. Okay, and then pull his head down. And with his arms, this is kind of a tricky part. His arms are the hardest, I think. The legs I got. Oh, there goes the shitty hinge again. It's really shitty, you guys. I'm so sorry. It's terrible. I think it's actually about to break, too. Hope it doesn't. But if it does break, I'll probably just put it back on. Like, with the, fix it up. And then probably just not even put him into truck mode anymore. Because it's a pain in the ass. So you just want to... Oh, you guys can't even see. Sorry about that. You guys want to get this thing. It's usually back here. You want to unhinge it and then pull it to the front. Same with the other side. Unhinge it. Pull it to the front. And with these little hinge thingies, right here, you want to kind of fold his arm in. Like that, just like that. With the blue hinge, you want to kind of rotate it, try not to break it off. And there's like a little clip right there. 
right, you can't even see, right, right, right about there, and there's a, you want to try to clip it on, which is, I don't think it's going to do it anymore, because I, I kind of fucked the thing up, but, it's, oh, well, there it fucking goes again, <clears throat> for fuck's sake, did I break it, okay, I didn't break it, but it's, like I said, you, you guys, it's a pain in the ass to transform this thing, this thing took me like three, three fucking hours to do, um, no, there, there it goes again. I won't even... Oh, for fuck off. I'm an optimist. I was so hyped for this figure, and I, I really love him, but... I'm gonna be a pain in the ass. Seriously, man. Okay, oh, fuck off. There. there you know, we're gonna leave you like that, because I, I genuinely don't give a single fuck anymore. Okay, same with the other arm. Kind of just twist that shit, and then put it in. Boom. You don't even have to clip it on. In fact, fuck that step. Just kind of clip his little flames. Oh, I got, I got a notification. For 25% battery remaining. Oh, that's that's nice. Totally. That's, that's great. I care about your notifications. In fact, I fucking care a lot. Um. Lost my train of thought there. I'm sorry. <clears throat> so you just want to hinge that shit on. You don't have to, just like me. You could say, fuck it, not hinge that shit on. Um, yeah, just, just fuck it, don't even hinge that shit on. Hinge that shit on, though. And then, now that you've done that, you want to kind of 360 his legs, like you did to transform him back into robot mode. So his legs are backwards, like that. Then what you want to do is unhinge these little car junk things that I said before. I'm going to do that. You want to do that, and then you want to... Why am I doing this? What am I doing with my life? What am I doing with my life? <clears throat> Ouch. And then, you want to pull this shit back up. And you want to do the same with the other one. This right here. Dude, my back hurts from leaning. I can't. I literally can't even do this anymore. It's so bad. My back hurts a lot. I feel like an old man, even though I don't know what an old man feels like. <laughs> this sounds really wrong. And then you want to do the, the twisty thingy with his leg. Like so. And then bend it up once you get to the silver part. And then it'll clip on. Don't worry about breaking it. It seems really sturdy. There's a lot of sexual jokes in this. Jesus. Let's have a clean mind. There you go. So there is legs. He's legless now. He now looks really retarded. Then what you want to do is kind of bend his legs inward. And then pull this out. Like this. You want to kind of bend the front of him. You want to bend it up. Actually, you want to lift the flap up. And then... That sounds really wrong again. Why am I even pointing it out? You guys know what I'm talking about. This is a pain in the ass, not gonna lie. And then you want to do the same with the other side. You want to pull it forward. And then under here, you just kind of want to get his legs under his chest piece. That's the main part. Oh, try not to break it. Okay, you kind of see it's coming together. Fold that, the gray stuff. Fold it inwards. You want to fold this one inwards. There's that. And then what you want to do is for the back, just ignore the front. Just kind of, ignore, yeah, ignore the front. You want to pull the top up, and you just want to pull out the um, doors, like so. And then for the back, there's these little gray pieces right under here. You just kind of want to pull them out, like that, and over. Same with the other one. Pull it back, up, and over. And then they do connect to do that, to keep your figure together. Now comes the tricky part. You want to come under here. Little tiny hinges. I don't think you can see them, but they're right about there. Little tiny. Yeah, you can't even see them. But they do clip on to something. So you have to look really hard when you're transforming this figure. Because, like I said, he's a pain in the ass. So you just want to kind of make sure they're together. You can squeeze them like so. And then there you go. Hopefully he won't fall apart. Now it looks like a hot mess right now. But he's, you can see he's coming, he's coming together. Making his truck. For the front, 
these arms that you made. Oh, well, there he goes. You want to kind of unhinge them, which actually wasn't even necessary to hinge them in the first place. And then you want to kind of bend them till you can get him into here. Slide him on in. Yeah. Oh my god, dude, I can't get it in. Mm. Okay, there you go. So it'll look like that in the end, and then do the same to the other side. This to ensure that it does not, like, the truck doesn't fall apart. And then for the front, as you can see, it's easy next. Just kind of connect it. Like so, oh, you guys can't even see, my bad. Oh my god, yeah, you want to make sure this thing does not hinge off. Okay, now for the front. Okay, there you go. There's the front. Oh, of course, it's doing that jackass thing that it did before. Oh, look, I'm gonna, I'm gonna close the front. Oh, look, would you look at that? The top cracked open. You know, I'm gonna fix the top. Oh, would you look at that? The bottom set. Fuck off. Why is this character so fucking complex? You know, you jackasses put Aiden up on the box. An eight-year-old can't even solve this. I'm fucking 14 and can't solve shit. Too much, man. Too much. Where are the people who made this thinking? Like, seriously, too much. I had to watch, like, a lot of YouTube videos to find out how to get this shit to work. There's that. Okay, I got the front working. Now, fuck off. Fuck that crack in the middle. I don't even give a shit anymore. Now, what you want to do with the doors... Don't break them. You want to kind of pull them out. Like, like so. And then there's a little gray piece right here. Um, you just want to kind of straighten it out. Because it will break. And then same with the other side. Just straighten that shit out. And then close the doors. I'm not even going to... Oh, God. Oh, my God. Fuck off. Stupid truck. You jackass. Just close the doors. Fuck, fuck this shit, man. You guys get the point. You know what? Here's your fucking semi-truck. Here's your fucking semi-truck. Way to go, Hasbro. Way to make a complex fucking toy with 30 freaking steps for 8 and up. This is totally 8 and up worthy. Yeah, 8 and up, okay? Fuck your 8 and up. Fuck your 8 and up. Fuck, okay, no, I actually love Barricade. He's, he's a nice figure, you know? He... This one's eight and up. Eight year old can build this. Fourteen year old can build. Anyone can build it. This shit. This shit. I can't build this shit. This is, no one can build this shit. How do? How do people freaking build this completely without doing that stupid fucking thing that I'm doing? Oh, it did it. Did it? What? What? Okay. Oh, did I did I finally find out how to do it? Oh fuck off. Fuck off. Look at the front just coming off and shit. Doors you stay inside like that. Shit you come on here. Oh okay, I did it. Sort of. Now for the top, there's little hinges. Not hinges, there's like little um clips. It's pretty easy to clip on, except when you're a dumbass like me, and you can't clip shit, and you just break shit, because that's how you are. And there, there you know what? Fuck your semi-truck. Is it, That's what, even, what it is. I'm not a car expert. Oh, would you look at that? The front came off again. But yeah, that's, that's Optimus fucking Prime. <sighs> Let's just move on to the bottom. Slide in his sword through there. Unless you're a jackass and don't know where to put the sword and you want to put it in his asshole. But it's fine. You can shove it up your asshole if you'd like. I don't mind. <clears throat> I don't, I'm not going to control your life. But basically, here here goes the shield shit. Fuck off! Shit, I broke it. Oh, fuck. Oh, no, it's being strained. Oh, shit. How did this piece of crap... Oh, man. Oh, shit. Okay, I can put this back on. You know what? This is Optimus Prime. You enjoy your, um, your premiere edition. Oh, oh, 15% battery. Yeah, yeah, you told me I had 25% left. Okay, you don't need to tell me I'm lower. Okay, fuck off. 
Okay. Here, here's your premiere edition. Optimus Prime, ages eight and up. Fucking eight and up, my ass. Okay. Man, sh shut the fuck, fuck this shit, man. Here's your fucking Optimus Prime. You know, I actually really like the box. I don't. I'm sorry, box. But yeah. That's that's the review. Okay. If I were to give this a uh, one out of not a one, I would not give it a one out of ten. I'm just saying, like, out of ten. I'd give the figure itself, like, when it's in robot mode, I'd give that a solid 9 out of 10. It's just these little hinge hinges. Where did I put it? Oh, fuck. Uh, these little sh hinges shit just come off like crazy. Like, shit just flies off, like, everywhere. It's, it's nice. I love the detail, but it just comes off way too easily. But 9 out of 10. Vehicle mode? I'd give that an 8 out of 10. Because... Oh my, these flames on the front, just everything, it's everything, it's just really, ugh, the color is nice, if you look at it, it's all destroyed and shit, but it's fine. Um, silver paint, as you can see, I kind of scratched it there, you probably can't even see it, but, um, uh, yeah, the black paint for the windshield, nice, better than this clear shit on Barricade, but I still love Barricade, he's my son. Um, yeah, the weapon storage, really nice, that's part of the 8 out of the 10. Pretty easy to transform from uh, car mode to figure form. Not that hard at all. Really easy. Other than that, it's gonna end this review. Fuck my my recording style. Fuck me. Um, get in your anus. <sighs> Enjoy the videos. Especially go watch my Minecraft house sex work videos because that's a really good video. Um, but yep. Yeah. See you guys.